Uh, so I was always interested in design and technology uh, at school. I uh, had some really inspiring teachers, uh, a really great metalwork teacher who uh, promoted creativity and practicality um, in, uh, in everything. With hindsight, really, I enjoyed problem solving, although I didn't realise that at the time. So I'm an engineer, um, but I'm also a soldier. Um, I am a project manager and a program manager. Um, I solve problems uh, around the world, um, uh, whether that's in conflict zones or disaster zones, um, making people's lives better, helping people live. Um, I happen to be gay, uh, and I also enjoy sailing. So I think the industry uh, can improve inclusion uh, through education and considering it as part of our professional um, development. Uh, leaders need to think about the benefits uh, of inclusion. Um, if you've got a member of your team who's not feeling part of that uh, team, isn't included, then they're not going to be um, performing to their best for you. You're not going to be maximising their, their impact uh, and your team won't be performing to its best. And I think what we've got to do is move past any belief that it's about political correctness. Um, it's all about making the team better. So I think the industry um, needs to dispel uh, any stereotypes that um, engineers are uh, all the same. The profession is uh, highly diverse with uh, people working in state-of-the-art offices in big cities and facilities all the way through to construction sites um, or in temporary facilities uh, in conflict zones or disaster relief zones around the world, putting people and countries uh, back on their feet. Uh, the range of disciplines and the levels that you can come in at um, are surprisingly diverse. Engineers should be too.